update. Okay, folks, thank you for joining the TFNN Afternoon Update. This is Larry Pesavento, and we have an evergreen day, folks. I mean, the boards are green everywhere with the exception of think silver and platinum are the only two things that are uh, in the green. Uh, we're in the red. Everything else is strong. As you know, we had some explosive moves this morning uh, right after the market opened. And a lot of that is related to the two-year note, which uh, I'll be discussing on my show that comes up in another few minutes. But the main thing is it's a very, very strong day. And uh, I think it's, uh, it's well, we're, it's just very, very strong. So you just got to respect that strength and figure it's going to go higher. When you take a look at the bond market, the bond market was down sharply uh, overnight and then most of the morning, and then it exploded to the upside when the Treasury notes started to move uh, high lower. In other words, interest rates started to drop. So what they're expecting now on Wall Street from the proverbial smart boys at uh, TF, uh, CNBC and also and Bloomberg is that they're expecting a rate cut. Now, if you believe that, Man, you better really, really look about what time Santa comes in Christmas time because I don't think anybody's looking at that. That's a real outlier event. And if we got that, that would certainly be bullish to the stock market. But even more bullish would be the fact that there would be a big change in the Ukraine uh, Russian war. That would be one that would really be a big surprise. I can remember that from when uh, we took out, took out Saddam Hussein, Hussein in 1991 in January. It only took, uh, you know, I think it took 26 or 30 hours to take the whole military operation uh, to get it completed. So that sent the stock market, you know, rocketing to areas that never anybody thought it would see. Yeah, I think it was the biggest update on a percentage basis of any day we've ever seen in the stock market. Now, folks, I am not predicting that war is ending. I'm just saying something like that could happen. So that's the main thing. So anyway, have a wonderful day. We'll have some more stuff going on here. My show's next, and then it'll be three, uh, three other people coming on, and Tom will wind it up at the end of the day. So we'll live every day in an attitude of gratitude, and may God bless.